It's Friday, August 17, 2012. I'm Don Owens with Social Security Works. This is our first edition of Social Security News, a review of some of the important news that occurred about social insurance and social security in the news media from this past week. This week, we're talking about two very important things, birthdays and campaign stops. Number one, this past Tuesday, was Social Security's 77th birthday. That's right, Social Security, a program with more than 20 years of solid funding and a $2.6 trillion surplus, this past Tuesday celebrated 77 years of success in supporting American families. Veterans, children, widowers, and people from all across the country celebrated the program's 77th birthday with the release of Social Security Works 50 state reports. Our second major news that happened about Social Security this week, at a campaign stop in Stewart, Virginia, Vice President Joe Biden said these words, and I quote, number one, I guarantee you, flat guarantee you, there will be no changes to Social Security. I flat guarantee you, unquote, from the Vice President. This is very important and very impactful because it's going forward, reporters can consider a number of angles about Social Security. Was this a new stance from the Obama administration? Was this stance finally brought public because it was Social Security's birthday? Was this stance brought about because Paul Ryan was chosen as the vice presidential nominee on Mitt Romney's ticket? Paul Ryan, of course, we will remember, a former Social Security recipient, but now national Social Security skeptic. So as we close, great stories to remember going forward and great angles to consider. Social Security, 77 years strong, supporting 55 million Americans. And Vice President Joe Biden coming out on behalf of the Obama administration and telling us, in fact, flat guaranteeing us, there will be no changes to Social Security.